Okay, cool, man. I can see it. Okay. So okay, since right we last spoke, I went through a training um, for what I do. Um, mm -hmm. I do mm -hmm. business credit, business funding. So I had a training. So I didn't have a lot of time and I had to, I had to take tests. And yeah, was a lot yeah, of stuff yeah. I was doing. So I didn't have time to build a build culture. So I just got on it probably two days ago. Okay. Um, and I noticed the money hit my, they took the money yesterday, which is, which is fine. Okay. So I, so I told myself, I said, look, within these next, within this next week or two, I want to, I want to be live and I want to be up and running. Perfect. So what I did was I integrated my Stripe, my PayPal. Um, I was in the middle of doing my calendar Okay. Um, but when I got to my calendar, when I got to a part of my calendar, it told me I had to um, set up a form. Yes. So I started setting up a form, and then that's kind of where I that's kind of where I stopped. So I already okay. got a form going. Um, I got a calendar going. So what okay. what I'm trying to do is just get it to try to get this thing going, man. I'm trying yes. to see the yes. quickest way. I'll, I'll, I'll tell you, you know, the, without the, being overwhelmed. Oh yeah, for sure. I'm going to give you the basic steps on like what to follow, like the blueprint on, on what it takes for, to just set up a quick funnel, like a quick funnel. And, and what I mean by a funnel is a landing page and a thank you page like that. Those, those two pages are the most important. Um, and then also when you set up a, a calendar, it's the form and it's the thank you page. It's the thank you for scheduling. So you have a landing page for whatever your offer is, People opt in and then they go to a thank you page. That's, those are two pages. And then you have, you have your calendar. And when people go to your calendar, they fill out a form. And when they submit that time and day to schedule an appointment with you, then, then, then they go to a thank you for scheduling page, which is a thank you page. So there's three pages. There's three pages, two forms, and one calendar. One form for your landing page, one form for your calendar. But but what I'll do is is let me let me have you jot this down. Do you have anything to write with? Yeah, I'm writing right okay, now. Okay, okay. Go yeah, yeah. go to my pages real quick. Go to my pages. Click on my pages right there at the top. My pages. So so yeah. So when you come into Karcher and and when you come in, you know, with a fresh idea and you're about to build something, and 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 you're about to start a different project or whatever it may be. Here's kind of the basic steps. Step one is your is your squeeze page or your landing page or opt-in page, whatever the hell you want to call it. That's step one. Step one is to just set up, and it's not even, it's not even taking the time to make it look all pretty and shit. It's really just, just get the damn thing up. Like, like, like click the green button, choose a template and just activate it like that. That's what I mean. So, so step one is just getting your squeeze page up and then you could take your time and edit it and change the colors and all that stuff later. But it's all about just getting okay. it up and publishing it live. So then you can use it to integrate with everything else. So step one is your sque is your squeeze page. And and the squeeze page is the landing page. Is the landing page, yes. Which if okay. we click on that green button, we can choose a squeeze page template. So step one is choosing your template. That's step one, your squeeze page template. Go ahead and click on it. Yeah, you can click on it. Right. Step one is is that squeeze page template. And then once you go into it and just get one going, then step two is the thank you page. Okay. okay. Step sure. two is the thank you page. And then step three is another thank you page. And that's going to be thank you for scheduling. We're going to, we're going to need that to tie to your calendar. We're going to need that to tie to the form of your calendar. Okay. So step one thank is you. your squeeze page. Step two is your thank, thank you, you page. page. And then step three is your thank you for scheduling page, which can also and be a <laughs> thank you page. And the step two page, they'll receive that once they get the ebook for free. Yes, yes. So if I go to your ebook page, which is your squeeze page, if I go right. there, I put my name and email, send me the ebook, I then need to go to step two, which is a thank you page. Okay. Okay, so step, step one, three, your squeeze page, you step two, your 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 thank you for downloading my ebook page. And then step three is your thank you for scheduling page. Okay. And then step four is setting up the form for your squeeze page. So the form that they're going to fill out when they download your ebook, that form, that's a form. So that's step four is the form for, for, for the landing page, the squeeze page, the ebook page. That's step four. Step five is another form 
for your calendar. Gotcha. Okay. Those are the, those are the basic steps, bro. And then, and then, and then you can, you, and then you can set up your calendar too. So go ahead and put that last, the calendar, the calendar will be last because you cannot complete the configuration of the calendar unless you have a form and you can't co complete the configuration of the form unless you have a thank you page. Oh, this is making a lot of sense. Okay. So, so, so that's, that's, that's why you got, you can have your shit up, but it's going to be pending right? Because the form is not connected to a thank you page or because the calendar isn't connected to a form. So that's why it's okay. in that order. I learned to just go in that order. Number Step one, squeeze page. Step two, thank you for downloading my ebook page. Step three, thank you for scheduling page. Thank and then schedule. step four is the form for the ebook and then the right. form for the calendar. And then you can go set up your calendar. That'll be the last step. But, but okay, it's, so step so, six, set up calendar. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, so it's really, it's really other than step five and six, because step, step five and six is the form. Step five is the form for the calendar. Step six is the calendar. So really your blueprint for any project this, this, from this day forward is really steps one through four. Or, or, or really step one, the squeeze page. Step two, the thank you page. Step three, the form. It's really, just, it's really step one, two, and three. Wow. It's, 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 because it's once order, everything is set up, Right. Once everything is set up, you, every time you drop a product, you don't have to do all of this over again. No, no, no. You can, you can, if it's a completely different product, yes, you're going to, cause you're going to want a different squeeze page. Let's say you come out with a different ebook. What you can do is you could always clone. So, so if you have a template, a squeeze page and, and you're like, okay, this, 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 this squeeze page is just rocking. Like I'm crushing it. Everyone's like liking it. Everyone's downloading my ebook. I'm going to come out with a new ebook. And what you can do is you can clone that page and just duplicate it okay i saw that i saw that so, like when you go to pages you, you can duplicate the page okay. yeah i do that a lot man i do that a okay. lot like i have one project i have one project and i have a ton of pages inside that one project but if i want to go start another project and it's very similar i'll just clone a bunch of pages and then just go and edit but at least the damn page is already done. All I got to do is go edit and maybe change the name from, from, from today's ebook to tomorrow's ebook. You know what I mean? Like it's just changing right. the words, if anything, but the, but the template is there, my colors. And that's the thing you want to just kind of, you, you want to stay consistent with, with, you want to stay con and write this down too. You want to stay consistent with your colors, with your colors. Like don't take me to a, to a squeeze page and the damn thing's purple. And then I opt in to download your ebook and the thank you page is red. You know what I mean? Like okay, keep, yeah. it, keep it flowing as far as the consistency and colors, keep your emails, the templates, keep those consistent, um, on your, on your pay, as far as the template of the email, which, which, which we'll get into, I'll show you, but then also keep footers like on all these pages that you start to put out, you'll have a footer and on the footer, that's where your copyright copyright at 2020, you know what I mean? Like make sure that that right. make sure that your social media icons are on your on the footers the social media icons i don't put that in the footer on the on the squeeze page but once that person goes to my squeeze page they enter their name and email and download my ebook and then they go to my thank you page i have my social media icons on that page in the footer so so every page and let's say for example now that person's about to get emails from me they're about to get emails from me and 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 they downloaded my ebook and now these emails that are going to start going out again, those, th those emails, the template you want it to map to be consistent. And I'll show you mine to give you an example, but they're basic. Like you can have a, a super decked out email template, or you can have a basic template. I just have basic templates, but the fact is that they're consistent because the footer, it just looks the same. It matches image matches like shit just flows. It just looks consistent as far as the aesthetics. And, and we're talking, right. basic. we're talking basics. Ain't nothing fancy. I'm just talking basics. Like, Right. Keep it, keep it, keep, keep the aesthetics of everything looking fresh. Um, and, 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 and so when someone receives my email, for example, um, it's the same template, they'll receive emails over and over and over same template. It, it flows with the, with the looks of it all. And then, and then if I have any videos in my emails, cause I have videos in all of my emails, pretty much not the video isn't in the email, but there's a, there, there's maybe an image or a button or I'll hyperlink a word. So I'll, I'll write in my email click here to watch my newest video and then boom right. right when they click that i take them to a 
a page. I take them to, let's say, maybe, maybe, maybe a long sales page, or maybe I'll take them to a, to a video sales page. Watch, click on video sales page. So in my emails, in my email, this is what you're going to want to do. As I go and download your ebook and you set up a handful of emails to follow all in your sequence, that's your email sequence. As you set up a handful of emails, don't just talk to me via text. Like, like what I would do if I were you, which is what I do. If you go download, download my book, I got a handful of emails that come out and yeah, it's, 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 it's maybe a paragraph in of text, but what I'm pushing you to is to watch my video. Now, not everyone's vi about video. You know what I mean? Like you may not be a video dude. I just, I just tend to express myself better with video. Right. I'm a visual person. So if right? I can see yeah. a so, person so, I'm, I'm, I'm doing business with, that's okay. better. Perfect. So, so this is what you're going to want to do. You're going to want to take a basic template like this, like that first one, for example, that first one right there, that one right there, for example, is what I use that first one with the, with the gray background, mm -hmm. that would be a page right there that I'll put in seven emails. And all I'll do is I'll create the page once and then I'll clone it over, clone it, clone it, clone it. And then I'll, and then I'll, I'll link it in every email with a different video. And then in my email, hey, John, thank you so much for downloading my ebook. Hey, man, remember on page nine when I was talking about getting your credit and wh what the difference is between your FICO score and this? Take a look at my video, man, where I break it down. It's a two-minute video, but I'm super fired up. Click here to watch now. And then, boom, they click in the email. It takes them to that page where they're watching your video. And then on that page, look, all you see is the headline, the, the white text, the blue text, that turquoise text or whatever, and then you see a video. At the bottom of that video, watch, click, preview, see if you could preview it. Just hover over it and click preview. This is a basic template that I would put in my emails. So if you hit preview, see that button right there, that blue one, sign up today. So this is my exact template. Now I take, I take off the credit card. You know, I, I, I clean it up a little bit because all I need is, is a headline. All I need is that video and all I need is that button. So in my videos, let's say it's a three minute video and I'm talking about credit. At the end of that video, and let's say this is email number three. He downloaded my ebook three days ago. This is email number three, and I'm talking about what's on page seven, right? I'm breaking it down. And so at the end of that video, if you're trying to get them on a call, I don't know your exact uh, sales process, but in my case, I'm trying to get people on the phone or, or, or on Zoom, not on the phone, on Zoom. I'm trying to get them you know, on a presentation or whatever. So at the end of my video, I'll say, hey, man, and if you want to dive deeper or if you want to really get all my secrets and strategies and really consult and really take on a free strategy call, click the button below. It will take you straight to my calendar where you can schedule your best time. Can't wait to talk to you guys. I'm excited to fire. I'm, I'm excited up and I'm fired up about helping you with your credit. You know, something like that. But I would say right. something like that at the end of the video. So a call to action with them to click the button. And, 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 and again, if that's, the, if that's the goal to get people on the phone, or, or, or on a Zoom call or whatever, then that's, that's how you want to fit those emails. Now, now if okay. you're shooting them to a product, if you're, shooting up to, if you're just shooting them to a product, that, 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 there's the call to action. Hey, guys, and by the way, this is a promotion we have going on for September where your first month you get a 30-day trial to our, our, our free credit um, analysis system where we're going to do this, this, and this. Click the button below. It'll take you straight to the sign-up page where you can enter your basic information and activate your account. It could work any way, okay. whether you're trying to get an appointment. Right, right. It just depends on. Yeah. It depends right. on where you're pushing. It just depends on where you want them at. Yeah. Right, yeah. right. Yeah. Okay. That makes and, sense. And, and if there's nothing that you're pushing them to, which there should be, obviously, there should be something we're pushing them to at this point. It ain't just emails just to, just, just to send you a damn email. It's like, no, man, there's something I want to share with you. There's more. You know what I mean? So, so this is a basic template that I'll do for email number one, and then I'll just clone it use it for email number two, clone it, and I'll just drop a different video. And, and that video that I have in there, I'll either host that video on Kartra or I can even host that video on YouTube and just grab the link and place it right there. Okay. okay. So, so, and then, and then again, you can, you can change the color, you can change all that stuff. So, so cancel out or just hit that red, hit that red circle, hit that okay. X. So, so step one, squeeze page. If we're, if we're just trying to get down to the basics, let's go to squeeze page real quick. Let's look at squeeze pages. And then, and then again, this is the skeleton. This is the template. You can always change it. You can always add. You can always delete. Um, but at the same time, the beauty is you don't really need to. Like, it's already there. Just edit the damn thing. Change colors. Add your image. Add the book image. Whatever. Um, try not to change too much of it because you don't need to. You right. know what I mean? 
So, um, <clears throat> yeah, yeah, I want to keep the same colors, like the same. Yeah. Even my ebook, my, my ebook has the same colors as my website and my logo, everything. You know what, man? You know what? Um, I'm gonna make shit real easy for you, real quick. Let me, um, let me share my screen. Let me share my screen real quick. Stop okay. share and just come back to me real quick. Come back to the Zoom um, window. Let me know if you can see my my um. Yeah, I can see you. Okay, so here's here's my book funnel. Okay, here's my book funnel. It, I'm driving. I'm drive. I have two different pages. I have I have one page, and I'm pretty sure I showed this to you yet the other time. But I'm gonna I'm gonna touch on it again because I'm gonna go further with you right now. Okay. This is a basic template. So free book reveals the top five steps. And then there's an image that I got from Fiverr, spent like 10 bucks, and the dude did a, the dude did a, did a design for me. <laughs> I do. <laughs> I right? did all my stuff from Fiverr, too. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so that's where the image would go. And then a few bullet points, send me the book now. Or download your ebook now. You know what I mean? And then, and then a few testimonials, and then, and then just these share links at the bottom. And then my privacy policy, and then my copyright at the bottom. Basic template. Basic template, but clean, fresh, and it converts. Okay. That's the free book that I got. And then, and then, and then here's, and then if you notice there's a countdown clock. So if people get here and that thing expires, then it goes to my sales page where they now have to buy it for a few bucks. So it automatically redirects them to my sales page. And, and, and now over here, it, it's, it's $5 and 50 cents. And now they got to buy it if they get timed out and, and end up over here. So this is a long ass sales page, which, um, which again, this is a template. This is a page that is already converting. All I did was came in here and I edited and made it my own. That's all I did. Like okay. the template was already there, bro. So, so that's the sales page. And then, and then when they go in, um, when they, when, when, when they get to the sales page and they enter their name and email, but they back out and they don't buy it. Then I have a series of emails that go out, getting them back to the checkout page to buy it. Right. So, right. so, so that's if they abandon the cart. So if they go to, if, if they didn't download it for free, they end up on the sales page. They, 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 they get as far as entering their name and email, but they don't put in their credit card. I hit them with three more emails back to back to back, getting them to this page to check out. Um, now, now once they download it, once they download it, they're then taken to this page, which is the thank you page. So again, mm. step one, the squeeze page, step two, the thank you, thank you page. And now on this thank you page, very basic, basic template on this. Thank you page. Oh, that's, that's real basic. Yeah, bro. You got to keep shit. That's simple. super basic. Yeah. yeah. We're, we're not building a full blown website. We're, we're direct response marketers. It's straight to the point type of shit. You got your page got to be clean and just basic and, and just straight to the point. Like, what am I trying to get them to do? You know what I mean? And so in this video, all I'm doing is I'm thanking them. I'm thanking them for downloading the book. That was number one. That's why I touched on on our, on our last call. I'm thanking them. I'm introducing myself. I'm telling them to check their email because I just emailed them the PDF to download the book. And then number four, I'm telling them to schedule a call. And that's exactly what I want to do because if I get okay. them on a call, okay. I, I can really show my products. Perfect. Okay, perfect. So then, okay. so then that's my thank you page. Now, after that, if they don't schedule the call, then over the next five days, step one, step two. So let me, let me open it up. Step one, step two, step three, step four, step five. So, so, so it goes up to step five. And then, and then I got these, I got this other one that ends up going out as well, but it, but it's basically six emails. Okay. Six emails in my sequence. These are the automated emails that go out the moment they download my book. Now, again, in the email, in fact, let me, let me show you the email because the email, it leads them to that video. It leads them to this page, step one. So here are the emails. So if I come into the, to my communications, I hover over communications, I click on sequences. These are all my sequences that I have set up. Um, these are the automated emails. Now you have two different things. You have your list. Anyone who opts into your ebook list and they download your ebook, they're going to be on a list but not every list needs a sequence. Now your ebook for sure. But if I just went to your, let's say calendar and I, and I, and I opted in and scheduled an appointment and now I'm on a list of your, and that's another thing you're going to want to do. So we're going to have a, we're going to set up a list for anyone who schedules an appointment. They're on their own specific list. Okay. 
Now that list of my appointments that I don't, I don't have a sequence for them. Cause I mean, I don't need to send them a sequence of automated emails. They, they scheduled an appointment. I got them on the phone. I told them everything over the, over a phone call or, or, or over zoom. I don't really have a sequence for that. So there'll be certain lists that you don't tie a sequence to. But in, in our case, if we both have a book, yeah, for sure. There's a sequence because there's a handful of emails that I'm going to send to them automatically to get them to do the next step. And so here is my sequence for the book. Um, it is this one right here. So as, as they download my book, again, these emails are going to trigger. Now in my email, I'll write out some basic text, but the whole objective, bro, is to get them to click to come over here. So to let schedule me show a call. To schedule a call. So here's step one of five. So a day later. So I have, I have it set up where right away they're going to get, they're going to get an email. They're going to get an email with the actual um, um, PDF the, the link to download. But a day later, that's my, this is my sequence. A day later, they're going to start receiving these emails. Okay. So here's a basic, my basic, here's step one of five. And so as I come in here, I'll, I'll walk you through the settings of all that, but let me just show you the actual email. So here's what I'm doing. Hope you're well and crushing it today in chapter four. So all I'm doing in my emails, I'm breaking down what they downloaded. I'm breaking down the book in chapter four of the social oh, yeah. real estate agent. I'm sharing with you the Break top the five steps to implement on social media. And then I put their first name. I'll put their first name right here. If you go to dynamic variables, you can copy and paste their first name. I put their first name everywhere. Greg, even if you think you're a super master black belt, social media marketing ninja, 99% of real estate agents miss this step. Out of my 5,000 friends on Facebook, on my personal page, click here to see for yourself. 499 are real estate agents. And then I truly believe it's super important when it comes to your social media branding. And that's why it's step one. Watch the video here. When they click that and see all this is, so here's what I mean by an email template. An email template, uh. I have my image, I have my social media icons because I don't want to have to put these damn icons on every damn email. It's like that should right, be time right. consuming. I ain't got time for that. So I just save as template. I'll do email number one, I'll make it look all pretty and shit. And then I'll save as template. And then, and then, and then that template will be over here. So if I come over here and I hit design templates, my templates, these are, these are basic templates right here that I simply saved from the previous email. And all I got to do is click, drag it over. And now I can use it for my next email. And of course I'll edit the words. Of course I may edit the image. Like my next image on, on email number two is step two. So for sure I edit the image, but what I really use a template for is, is mainly the image space and then these icons, because these icons are the most important. I don't want to keep recreating these every time. Right. So, I'll just, I, so it's a basic template. It's a basic template. So when they click watch the video here, it then takes them to this page over here. Now, now I'm linking my YouTube video, but what you can do is you can upload that video to, to Kartra and then, and then this could be a Kartra video. But I link it to my YouTube video because I'm actually building a YouTube channel. Right, and right, and I, right. I want people to start getting you know, familiar with this red YouTube logo and my damn face. You know what I mean? So, right. so that's why I'm linking it to a YouTube video. But, but the reason why I link it to a page and not because I could have easily, and what a lot of people do is they'll link this to their YouTube channel, to the video, but on their YouTube channel. So for example, for example, if I am linking, let's just say I'm linking... Let's say, let's say this is the video right here that I'm linking. What a lot of people do, man, and I, and I catch even some of my mentors, like dudes that I'd be following that are 10 times further than me, I'd be catching them sometimes. Like they'll send me an email, like I'm on, I'm on a few people's list or whatever, right? They'll send me an email, they'll send me an email, and when I click watch the video here, I click, and then boom, I'm over here on YouTube. Wow. And it's like, damn, okay. That's Before good marketing though, right? Be what? That's good marketing though for, for the No, YouTube. no, no, no. It's horrible. It's horrible. It's horrible. Oh, it's horrible. Okay. It's horrible. And I'm going to tell you why. It's horrible. Because if you're like me and you got ADHD and your shit's all, your mind is all over the place. Okay. Go ahead and send me that email. Let me click. You're taking me straight over here. And before and you know it. you're going to click on something else. <laughs> dude, before you know it, I'm watching, I'm watching freaking value tainment. Before you know it, I'm watching drink champs. Before you know it, oh, I'm watching yeah. Kevin Hart. Yeah. So it's yeah. like, you're only going to have my attention unless I'm super, super on it. 
but but most people on your list they're not super super only a few bro like only a few like you're a perfect example only a few reach out to me for help on Kartra. only a few but yeah. how many people do i got on on youtube almost 3000 only a few so so as you build out your email list it's only a few that are super engaged so the other let's just call it 95% you take them to YouTube, and before you know it, bro, they're watching car chases. So don't right. take me straight to YouTube. Take me to a page where you have my undivided attention. Now, that video right. could be a YouTube video. It could be a YouTube video. Okay, and yeah, you may end up clicking one of these. You may end up clicking up here, and before you know it, you're on my YouTube channel. But at least I can at least buy a little bit more time. At least right. I can keep your attention a little longer because now I got you secluded. I got you right here where I want you on one single page. That's number one reason. I keep your attention a little longer. You're not over here looking at all these other damn videos to, to take your attention away from me. So, I, so number one, I, catch your t I keep your attention a little longer because I got a message. I got a video. I want you to watch it. I sent you an email. Watch the video here. I'm taking you straight to one page. I keep your attention a little, little longer. That's step one. Or that's reason number one. Reason number two is because if I took you to YouTube, I cannot track that. If I take you to my one page, I could track that with my Facebook pixel. Oh, wow. So, so I know Greg landed over here. Now, now I don't necessarily know him, no, no, no name. And I don't necessarily know the name. I, I can't call him out, say, Greg, you landed there. I know for a fact you did. Actually, you know what I can, because I could check the analytics through Kartra and Kartra, when that email goes out, Kartra is going to tell me, Greg clicked. So I can track it on the Kartra side. But as far as, as far as the Facebook side, why do I want to track it with my Facebook pixel? Because if people are landing here, I can now create a custom audience inside of Facebook. Mm -hmm. Now, all these people that are on this specific page, I can now put in a custom audience to run future ads to them on Facebook. Or let's say, for example, Greg downloaded my ebook. Now he's receiving my emails and now I'm taking him to this page and now I'm Facebook pixeling them. Let's say for example, and now I'm putting them in a custom audience. What you're going to want to do with that audience as you continue to run Facebook ads to promote your ebook, what you're going to want to do 1000% is exclude this audience from seeing your ads. Because I'm already in your pipeline, bro. I'm already on email number nine with you. Right. I right, already downloaded I, your ebook. Why do right. I keep seeing your damn ads? Right, right, right. You need to exclude me. So that's why this page allows my Facebook pixel. It allows me to create a custom audience. And now I can exclude this audience from seeing future ads about my ebook. I couldn't do that if I took you straight to YouTube. Right. And then that's reason number two, the Facebook pixel the custom audience. Reason number three is because now I got that one call to action. So in my video, I'm saying hey, at the end of my video, I'm saying, Hey, and by the way, watch, let me see if you can hear it. In my professional consumer opinion. So you're right. So again, step one, the branding to the next level and to start capturing multiple leads on social media. All right, guys. So Get that part set up, and if, and, if you, and if you can't do that for whatever reason, if, if for some reason you're stuck on that, click the button below. It'll take you straight to my calendar where you can schedule the call. There you go. Be doing this. In fact, I have a video I can just send you that walks you through it. So schedule a call with me. I'd love to kind of share my two cents and give you even more information on, on, on all of that and, and, and really keep it simple. See your boy, your boy ain't playing around, G. Your boy ain't playing I around. See, I, I see. I, 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 I'm having I them see. click the link. I'm having them click the link. I'm telling them in the in that video, click the link, go to my calendar, schedule the call. So so as you fill up the top, the top of the the top of the funnel is running that Facebook ad, getting people to download that ebook. That's the top of the funnel. That's the squeeze page. I need people to get to that page. I need people to enter their name and email. I want to. I, I got to get people to download the book. But the back of the funnel, the back is that email automation. Those emails, as these emails go out, as these emails are going out to hundreds of people, that's when, that's when stuff starts to crack. 
That's when your business and that's what I need. Test. And that's what I need. So yeah. let me ask you this. So how long does it take to do all of this? Like to, to I'm about to like, bless you right now, bro. I'm about to freaking okay. it's about to be Merry Christmas right now. I'm gonna give you my entire funnel. I'm gonna give it all to you. All you gotta okay. do is go in there and edit it. But at least okay. the damn blueprint will be there. So oh, man. here's what I'm about to do. I'm about to give it all to you. All I'm about to package it up in a red bow right now, and I'm gonna do it right in front of you. Here's how you here's so 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 when you the, the beauty about Kartra is that as you look, here's 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 another here's another income stream for G. Here's another income stream for you in the future. Another income stream for you. Once you build this out and you get this ebook funnel going, do you understand that that right there is knowledge? And do you understand that you can now go out there and start teaching people how to get their ebook out? And as right. you now have a funnel, you can start getting people onto Kartra and giving them the funnel, or you can sell them the funnel. See, my whole intention was to get you onto Kartra and just give it to you. Because I want you to keep this damn thing. I want you to succeed with it. Right, because you get a percentage. Right? Exactly. So, so that's what I'm in it for. I'm in it for that long-term residual income. You know, so, but, but I can easily, I could, I, what I'm about to do right now, package up my whole damn funnel, I could easily sell it to you. So it's like a future income stream for you is you're going to have an entire ebook funnel. Do you know how many people would pay for that for you? Like, to you, how many people would pay for that? But at the same time, if you were just saying, hey, man, just get on Kartra. It's all good. I'll help you, and I'll give it to you. You could do that, do, do that too and just make that residual income. But, but that residual income is not a huge income, but it adds up as a ton of people start to get going. But, but another income stream could be, number one, teaching people how to create an ebook. Number two, selling them your funnel. See, and you know what's you know what's cool with this? I saw so many other people on YouTube that was doing the same thing that you do as far as assisting with Kartra, giving knowledge about Kartra, and dropping their link. And it all made sense to me. But what I did was I did my homework. I said, you know, I'm gonna find the right person Man, and I'm just gonna deal with one person. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, I'm gonna not gonna deal with 20 different people that's trying to give me the same information. So, man, I appreciate this. Man, I bro, feel like I did a good job you. finding you. You know what I mean? That's what's up, man. Now I'm about to just bless you. Now I'm about to just give you my entire funnel, which is going to cut the time in, 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 in a fraction. Like now, now you're going to have to go in there and edit it, obviously, but at least you're, you'll have everything. You'll have everything. So here's what, I'm, here's what everything is. I'm about to package it up right now in front of you. So this is how you package up. So as I'm saying, once you get your thing cracking, you're going to be able to package it all up and just sell it to somebody. Or you can package it all up, and if they get on Kartra with your, with your affiliate link, maybe you could just give it to them. You know what I mean? Right. So, 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 so here's how you do it. I, have, I created everything. I created everything, right? So now this is how you package it up. So I click on my campaigns, and then, I, and then, and then I'm right here in my campaigns, and I'm going to click on this green button right here. And this campaign name is going to be ebook funnel ebook funnel okay so this is how you package up everything <clears throat> and throw it in throw it in in one in one share code so here's what i'm going to do and i'll add an image later just to save us some time but but the first step is is adding an image adding an image right there in fact you know what shit i'm going to just do this real quick cuz it'll take me one second so what I do, so, so the image 286 by 156, 286 by 156, 286 by 156. Wow. You just, you just showed me something right there too. What Canva? <laughs> okay. Well, I know about Canva, but how you just, you know, you saw the requirements from Kartra and you went over to Canva yes, and yes, put the exact yes. requirements. Yes, in. bro. Yep. That's what you want to do for sure. So, so here's what I'm doing. I'm just, and all this is just a thumbnail, the thumbnail for the actual package uh, for the funnel. So, so all I'm going to do is I'm going to add, I'll just add something random, um, which is actually this book funnel. It's actually this one. So I'm going to just add this one. Okay, cool. So I'm going to just download it real quick and then boom, I'm going to, I'm going to add it to the, to the, to the thumbnail right here of, of the packaging. 
So there's that. There's that. Okay, perfect. So cool. So we'll see what that looks like at the end. Okay, so there's the thumbnail. And then I hit save. And then now I hit save and next. We already added that. And this right here, remember in Kartra, everything is interconnected. You must include all assets contained within the campaign. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to give you my squeeze page. I'm going to give you my freaking thank you page. I'm going to give you all the damn templates in the email. I'm going to give you my email sequence with all the freaking text, bro. Like all the verbiage, all you're going to do is look at it and be like, okay, let me just reword this shit. Like, I'm going to give you the entire freaking funnel, bro. Like, I don't, I, I don't think I've ever done this, but, but you and I are on the same. I appreciate that. Yeah. It, I it, appreciate it, that, brother. Oh man, it's all good. So, okay. I understand. And then boom, this is where I can build it out. So everything I've already created, I'm going to add it to this package. So, so the product, in fact, I'm going to even add the product because again, as you go to the free page, there's that countdown clock. If you don't, freaking shit or get off the pot it's going to redirect you to the sales page where you got to buy it for five bucks that's the product so the social real estate agent book that is the five dollar and fifty cent product so i'm going to add that just so you can know what it's like and you can reword it change the image and all that the list as they come and download that book they're on a they're on a list okay so that list you're, you'll be able to come into your account and just edit the name so the list is going to be um, 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 book, or is the book? Okay, so I got two different lists. I got a free book. Are you going to be buying or selling yours, or, or is it free? No, no, no. Mine is going to be free because okay. I'm, 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 I'm doing a free book, and Perfect. I'm, I'm going to lead it up to a course. Perfect. Okay, so there's, there's that. And then what I'm – I think that's the only – yeah, that's the only – Let's see. And then also, you know what? Scheduled appointments. I'm, I'm going to include scheduled appointments as well. So if anybody scheduled an appointment, then they land on that list. Okay. So just go in. When you see it in your account, you're going to just edit the, edit, edit the name of it, obviously. But at least you'll see it there. You'll know, you'll know what goes there. So as they schedule an appointment, they go onto that list. Okay. Now the tags, I'm going to also include some tags. So the tags are just a way to categorize everything. It's a way to search. It's a way to automate. It, 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 we'll go into tags more later on our future calls, but I'm going to just include them just right now. So the, the tags is I'm tagging anyone who, who gets the free book and then, and then, and then, and then that's it. You don't really need the other one because the other one's for, for my course, but you don't really need that one. That one's the only one free book customer. So they're tagged the pages. So I'm going to come down here and I'm going to, I'm going to include the, um, the book checkout page. That's if people are buying it but you might not need that one. So just, um, actually, you know what? I'm not even going to include it because I don't want to confuse you. Put, I don't want to add more than what's needed. So, so um, you don't need that one, but I'm going to include the, let's go with, um, where is it at? Free book. We're going to go with the free book page. And then we're going to go with the, I'll even include the privacy policy because you're going to need those privacy policies that goes at the bottom refund policy. You, you might not need that right now, but it's good just to have the template. I might as well just include all this right now. Um, and then, and then, and then, and then let's see what else is there. And then step one, step one, that's email number one. That's a page, uh -huh. right? Uh -huh. And then, and then step two, step two, that's another page. And so all I'm doing in all my emails, man, you might use all these, you might not, but, but this is my entire funnel, bro. This is exactly what, what I'm rocking with. As they get email number four, click here to watch. Now I'm taking them to a page, you know, I'm taking them to a page. Um, and then, and then step five, step five. Okay. Got that. And then boom, the terms of use. I just saw that you're going to need that. And then you'll just edit all the, all, you know, edit my name out of it or whatever. Um, oh, of course. And then, um, and then the book sales page, I'm going to actually, no, I won't actually, I'll just include that for the hell of it. That's a long form sales page. Um, that's my, that's where I'm selling it for $5 and 50 cents, but, but it's a long sales page, but at least you'll, you'll have it just to have an idea. Um, and then, and then what else, what else, what else? Um, 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 um. There is free book. Oh, free book. Thank you. There's the thank you page. Okay, cool. So you got, you got the, you got the squeeze page. You got the privacy policy, refund policy. You got step one, two, three, four, five. Um, and then the terms of use and then the thank you page. That is the entire 
page funnel, bro. So all you got to do is just oh, come man. in here and, and, and just edit the damn thing. Now the sequences, the sequences, the email sequence, the email sequence. So you're going to see my verbiage. You're going to see my email. You're going to see it all. And, and all you do is just go in there and just edit the damn thing. Um, so that one is going to be this one right here, book five steps. So that's the sequence. That's the sequence. And then the form, the form, as they go and they go to my squeeze page, they got to enter their name and email. That's the form. Um, and then let me include a calendar form. I might as well include the, the calendar form as well. Shared calendar. That's a form for your calendar. So, and then automations aren't needed. Calendar, calendar. I might as well, actually you, you set up a calendar, right? Or, or do you kind of somewhat set up the calendar? I kind of set one up. Okay, so you're good with that. Um, and, then, and then videos, videos, you don't really, um, yeah, my videos are on YouTube, so they're not even on Kartra. So that's it. That's it. So, so save. So I'm giving you one product slot, two list, um, one tag, 11 pages, one sequence, and two forms. And so keep it private. So here's the thing with Kartra. Okay. Let's say I got, I got this badass funnel. What I could really do is I could list it in Kartra's marketplace. There's over 20,000 people now on Kartra. So when you come over here to my affiliate promos on the bottom, you open this up over here, my affiliate promos, there, there's what we call a marketplace in, in the marketplace. There's people that have products. There's people, digital products, courses, whatever. I saw this. Like, like you can come in here. If you're an affiliate, you can come in here and grab a link and they'll pay you 50%. You know, some of them are, you know, this one's 67 bucks. You know, there's more, look, this one's 1497. You know what I mean? So, so there's different ones in here and you can always promote these other people's products. But what you can also find in here, if you go to all markets, there's different categories but what you can also find in here are funnels. So if I put together this badass funnel, I can then list it in the marketplace and I can sell this bitch for 500 bucks. And, 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 oh, wow. and, and people in the marketplace in Kartra, the Kartra community, they can see it and be like, damn, okay, he's including all these pages. He's including this sequence. He's including that. 497, okay, shit, I'll buy it. Because people see the value in this because you're saving them so much time, bro. Like you're saving them so much right, time. Right. Yes, they got to go and edit and make it fit their brand or their product, but it, the whole damn thing is there, though. You know what I mean? So, so, so I could easily list it, but I don't. I, I don't know. I, I just don't. That's just not part of my income stream or whatever. So I just leave it private, and and then I just and then and I hit save, and then save and next, and I'm finished. So now I come back to my campaigns, and I come over here. So here are my different campaigns, and and here's the thing: these other ones, seller guide funnel buyer guide funnel, open house listing, all this stuff, bro. I normally teach my daytime hustle is teaching it to real estate agents. My side hustle is teaching it to folks like you. that are finding me on YouTube. And That's I don't know if I, I don't know if you remember what, um, me telling you this, my wife is a Georgia realtor. Oh, I told, I, I remember, I remember for sure. So, so, so I told her, I said, let me get things going. Let me, let, let me yeah. get everything on autopilot. And then I'm gonna put you on the David. Yeah, so yeah. Have, get have all your get stuff at, together. Yeah, for sure. Have her get at me because they're just basics, man. And I ain't got nothing crazy to sell her. It's just these basics that I share with her. And it's like, man, let me show you what you got to do to your Facebook page. Let me show you what you got to do to your Facebook business page. Like I'll show her how to do everything herself. Because right. again, everyone's missing it. Every agent misses the basics when it comes to all this stuff. But my point of showing you this part is the fact that when I do get agents on Kartra, I end up just giving them these different funnels. And they're like, holy shit, you're going to just give me all that shit? I'm like, yeah, just get on Kartra and I'm going to give it all to you. So, so, so depending on your business, like in your case, in your case, what you'll want to do is start getting some funnels going for credit. This is your first ebook. Yeah. But, but start getting some credit ones going, some, some basic squeeze page, thank you page, like some basic ones for credit. So when you start recruiting people and you start getting people on your credit team, you can get them on Kartra and say, Hey man, I got these funnels already done for you. Let's start driving traffic and start getting leads. Right. Right. So, so I just stay on deck. I keep, I keep these funnels on deck. So if I got to give them to my clients, I'll give them. So, so here's what's going to happen. This is the ebook that I just created for you, the ebook funnel. So all I got to do is click on these dots. I'm going to click share. And then I'm going to simply add in your 
um, information. So what's your Kartra email or your Kartra login, your, your username or whatever? My email is on time solutions group at gmail.com. Is that the one you use to log into Kartra? Uh, yeah. Are you sure? Uh, hold on. Hold on. Let me make check, sure. Check. I don't Go want, to Kartra real quick I don't and log in. It. All right, hold on. I just need that. I don't need the password. I just need your login. I need your username. Okay, hold on. Hold on, why do I feel like I'm stuck? Hold on. No, it's all good. Hit escape if you got to get out of my window. Perfect. You see so me? now let's log in right here and then you'll see a red dot right there. Red number one, my campaigns. Bam. So all you're going to do is, <clears throat> all you're going to do is click on that and then you're going to go to available campaigns right there where the red number one is. And then you're going to hit these three dots right next to, um, right there, hit those three dots and you're going to accept. Bam. Oh man, I appreciate this brother. That's, that's it right there, bro. So hit, hit close and then campaign successfully imported. And I think you might see a quick video. Um, actually no video. Okay, cool. So, so now click on my products. Let's start from the top real quick. Click on my products. Actually, no, go to, I'm sorry. You got to go to, go back to my campaigns. I think we got to deploy it. Go back to my campaigns. You accepted it. Go to my campaigns on the bottom. You accepted it, but now we have to deploy it. So, so hit my campaigns okay. and now go to available campaigns at the top. And then now we're going to hit the three dots and we're going to deploy it. Bam. Okay. Now you got everything. So, so all this is a prefix, just, just, just abbreviate it. You can always delete it later, but put like, I don't know, put 2020 or put, put something, put just a few letters. Like ebook 2020? Even shorter than that. Like just a brief, like a few letters, like, or, or maybe 2020, but you'll be able to, you're going to be able to delete that and you'll see where that is at. You'll, you'll be able to delete it, but yeah, hit import. And then, and then that's, that's that man. So now that entire, so, so I'm not, so I'm not live on anything right now. Like no. once I, once I edit everything, how do I go live with all of this? You're going to publish live. So as you, so wa watch this video real quick. Okay. Okay. So now let me just walk you through everything on the left where everything is at. So let's start from the top, my products, you'll have a product spot right there and you can just edit, go through it. And, and see, there's that 2020. So now as you hit edit, click on the on edit right there at the bottom, edit above, um, yeah, to the left right there, bam, edit. So now you can, now you can edit the product and you can, and you can name it whatever you want, right? Name it whatever you want. And this is again, if you're selling it. So your stripe would be tied to this. This is the product. So this is what we're selling. Now we're going to be giving the ebook away for free. So this ain't going to pertain to your, your deal right now, but I just, I just gave you that spot anyway. So, so any product that you want to sell in the future, the book, I would suggest get, here's what you want to do. Start off with the book being free. And then as you get out a good amount, maybe 20, 30, 40, 50 copies or whatever, start selling it for a few bucks. Okay. And, and, and get people's reviews, get people's testimonials, you know, and, and, and that might be part of your email sequence. As someone downloads the ebook, maybe on email number four, hit them with a review. Say, hey, John, right. hey, man, thank you so much for downloading my ebook a few days ago. Hey, man, hopefully you're able to get through it. Will you do me a huge favor, bro? And would you simply write me a review? Let me know what you thought about it because I'm going to publish this live on my page and, 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 and I want to just share it with the world if you had a good experience or if you learned something new. You know what I mean? Okay. Like start getting right. reviews. Because as you get these reviews, that's going to justify why it's five bucks. That's going to justify why it's nine ninety five. Right. You know what I mean? Okay. Then you'll start to be able to sell it. And, 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 and the reason why selling it could be very, very important because selling it can start offsetting your Facebook ad cost. Mm. So if you sold it for five bucks, okay, shit, we're running Facebook ads at five bucks a day. So if I just sell one a day, that at least helps me break even. Right. Or if I'm selling it for nine ninety five and I'm running Facebook ads at 10 bucks a day, I'm going to sell way more than one per day. But if I sold one at nine ninety five, shit, I broke even. Right, right, right. You know okay. what I mean? But you can only get to that point as far as selling something when you have reviews. When you have reviews, then it's good credibility and people are like, okay, shit, I'll buy it. 
You know what I mean? Right. So that's why I didn't cr- try to create a course. I wanted to lead up to this. You know what I mean? Yeah. Oh yeah. That, that, that's next. That's next. As you, as you get this part going, I'll help you with the course. Cause that's where I'm at right now. I got 55 videos in my course. So, oh, wow. so, and it's all about this. It's all the same topic, all about the damn book. Like it's, it's everything I'm teaching in my book. I'm now just teaching via video. And that's a 55 video course that I'm selling now for 997. Nine, wow. 997, right? So, so let's cancel out of this real quick, but this is the product spot. This is the product spot. Just cancel that real quick. You. you can always get back to that and then hit my communications. So in here, you're going to have list. This right here will give you a list of all your leads, every lead, but we're not, we don't have any leads right now. So you're seeing it blank, but click on list right there at the top, click on list. And then you'll see two lists. One list is the ebook. One list is the calendar. And then again, you can just hit that pencil to the right and edit that title. And there goes that 2020. So you can always edit that 2020, but that is the list. And then if you hover over communications, you'll see, you'll click on sequence. This is the sequence. So you got my entire freaking blueprint, bro. Like on the sequence, just follow that email. <laughs> um, and, 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 and you'll click on the pencil to the right. We'll go over that on our, on our next call. If we can, let's schedule another call, like either tomorrow or Saturday or, or, or whenever, like, like ASAP, because I want to be able to show you the okay. next steps of everything else, but um, click on my pages. So now you'll see a list of, you'll see all your pages here um, laid out, all the ones that came over. So those are all the pages right there, bro. So um, the template is there, man. The template is there. Um, click on my forms. So you should have two forms over here. One for the, or yeah, one for, actually go ahead and get, get rid of the ebook one, the configuration incomplete. Just hit the three dots and delete that one. Because you'll just use that that other one. So you got the 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 ebook, the free the free book right there, 2020, and then you got the the calendar. So again, once you go in and click edit, you can change that title, 2020 free book, name it whatever the hell you want. Um, and then and then you got my calendars. Click on click on my calendars. You 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 now have two calendars, but go ahead and delete one of them. Um, that way you don't have too much going on. So maybe get rid of, actually, that's, that's the one Say so, yeah. So I brought, we brought that one over actually, actually, no, 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 no. That's that's remember yours. you said I, yeah, you're you said right. I already had one. So you're right. I'll just you're right. One. You're right. That's yours. Here's what the next step is. Here's what's super important. Click on my integrations. I don't know if we covered this the first time around, but click on my community, my integrations. Did you add your, okay, perfect. Your email is right there. Info at, at on time. Perfect. So there's your email. And, and that, that's that bro. That's that. If we can set up another call and I can literally walk you through everything else in more detail, that would be good. Um, okay. So what do, you suggest, right now. what do you suggest me do between now and then? Cause we probably could schedule a call probably on Monday if you're available. Oh yeah. Yeah. Schedule a call, that. schedule a call Monday. If, 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 if you have the time today, today at 4 PM Eastern, Every, every Tuesday and Thursday at 4 p.m., Karcher does that live Q&A. So if anything, bro, like jump on that. Jump on that Q&A at 4 p.m. if you can. Have you registered for that? I did. I did. Okay. Register for that. If you can jump on that, bro, I'm telling you. I tell people all the time, I'm like, man, the two most important, this goes for any business owner listening to this call right now, man. I tell this to, to people every single day as I'm consulting business owners. Small business owner, big business owner, I don't give a damn what type of business owner, every business owner. If anyone today in 2020 and on is trying to build something on the internet, if you're trying to capture a lead, I don't care what kind of business you got. You're in the business of, of, of gathering customers. You're in the business of getting clients. You're in the business of generating freaking leads, bottom line. If you're trying to do that online today, the two most important platforms is Facebook to run the traffic or that could be Instagram or that could be YouTube. But, but number one is paid traffic. And I would suggest starting with Facebook. Facebook, number one, and then Kartra, number two. Those are the only two damn things I should be putting my time into and should be putting my money into if I'm building a business today online. Bottom line. Right. And, e- gotcha. and even if gotcha. I'm not necessarily building something online, if I was just a random yoga studio down the street, 
but I'm trying to leverage the internet and I'm trying to meet people on social media and I'm trying to get people a seven day pass to my yoga gym, Facebook ads, Kartra. Like those are the only two damn things. So all of our time needs to go here, bro. All of our resources, all of our budget needs to go right. to those two damn things. So if I got to, if I got to delegate, you know, or no, not delegate. If I have to allocate, meaning if I have to put time aside to be on these Karcher calls to learn the damn thing, I got to do that. And if you can't make it live, they, they'll, they'll send you the replay, right? Like if you can't make it live, they'll send you the replay, but make sure you watch the damn replay because you got me, you got me whenever you need me. But the Tuesday and Thursday calls, you're going to learn a lot from that as well. And okay. even, even if okay. it's a Q and A, so the, the, it's, it's Karcher support team. They just, they just come on and, and it, they just, they just freestyle the whole damn thing. So it, it, it's, it's on everybody who's, it's, it's up to everybody who's on to ask questions. So you come on, Hey man, how do I put together an email sequence? Hey man, how do I set up a list? Hey man, how do I set up my calendar? They'll, they'll screen, screen share just like I am. And they do that for an hour. And this, the, this, the, the, uh, these are the nerds behind Karcher, bro. It's like their actual support team. Okay. This ain't no random dude like me. You know what I mean? Right, right, right. So, so, and, so, you know, and you know your shit too, bro. That, that I mean, I've been doing this for not even that long, but but it's it's basic, bro. Like once you get start, once you get started, um um, you'll learn this shit. But but someone like me, I live in the damn thing all day. I'm making YouTube videos on the on the damn thing all day. So yeah, I get I'm putting more hours than everybody else. But I'm telling you, it doesn't even take all that. Like even if you have a full time hustle and you're doing this on the side, just make sure you're on these trainings. Make sure you leverage me. Like I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm gonna be available for you anytime you need me, bro. So schedule calls, schedule calls. But after a few, I already know you're gonna know this shit like the back of your hand, and you'll start oh, yeah. teaching other people. Oh yeah, you already know, brother. You know, I, I appreciate everything so, you're doing. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So, so, so get on today's call, and and get on today's call if you can, and start asking questions about this funnel that I just gave you. Okay. Like, like, how do I publish the page live? You know, like right. little basic whatever the hell's on your mind. And, and okay. you just put it into the chat and they'll answer it. And they don't get off okay. the call until they answer everyone's question. Okay. So, so even if you don't have questions, jump on because you're going to learn a ton of shit. Even if you don't have a question, you just, there's been many calls where I just come on just to listen, just to see what everybody else is talking about. And I'm just a fly on the wall learning it all. That's how I That's learned right all this. Then. Right. Because it's that important. Facebook ads, Kartra. Those are the only two things I've been doing, bro, since 2018. Those are the only two things. I, I put my blinders on. I ain't looking at nothing else. And it's those two things. So, how, so how much would you say you spend on ads uh, a month with Facebook? It, it, every, every budget's different, but it, ha, it, it all has everything to do with what you're selling. Like, like, like first of all, if you're not selling anything up front and you're looking at it for just get, get, getting leads, then you're going to have a different budget than everybody else. So you have to look at it and approach it in a way where I am paying for leads because you're going to have to pay for leads with anything. You're going to have to buy leads. You're going to have to create leads. You're going to have to get leads anyway. A lot of times people think that they run Facebook ads straight to sell some shit. It's like, no, it's not, it's not always that way at all. You're not running Facebook ads to sell something all the time at all. The way you want to look at a Facebook ad is it's the top of the funnel. What's it going to cost me to generate leads? Because once uh -huh. I get a lead, I sell them on the back end. It's not selling right. them on the front end because I'm giving away the damn bu the book for free. Right. So, but, but there's a cost per lead. So, so once you start running ads, you're going to start figuring out what your cost per lead is. And, 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 and you're going to also figure out if that's going to be, you know, freaking within your budget. You know, right. you'll start at five bucks a day. You'll start at five bucks a day. And, 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 then, and then you'll just, as you start to capture more leads, maybe you might increase it to 10 bucks a day. At 10 bucks a day, maybe, 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 maybe seven, eight, nine people are downloading your book every day. And, and these people that are downloading your book are now in your email sequence. And maybe the way you have it set up is in your email sequence, you're asking people to schedule an appointment just like I am. And then once you get them on the phone, you're closing them as a new client for 500. You're closing them at, on a new, as a new client for 1,000, whatever it may be. That's the price point. So, if, so, so if, if, it, if you're making, let's just say $500 for every client on the back end that you bring aboard, that's how you want to look at it. Okay, great. Out of, out of so many eBooks, it costs me, it might cost me $75 to get 50 people to download this book. But out of the 50 people, I end up bringing aboard two clients and I make $1,000. Mm -hmm. That's how you have to look at it. 
So, so, so if, if, so if it don't, so if it costs you up front 300 bucks to run ads, $10 a day, but on the back end, you made, you made a G. That's how many right. times over do you want to do that? Right. I see I'll do that saying. shit every damn day. Right. I see so what you're so saying. everyone, mm -hmm. everyone has a different cost, but, but to really answer your question, you're going to start small. You're going to start small five bucks a day. You know, you're going to start small. And, and just really, and, and, then, and then after a few days, you'll start to see the cost per lead. That's what you're looking at, the cost per lead. And then you have to have that back end on point. So as these people are receiving emails, there has to be something else we're selling them. So in, in, your, in your case, if you're trying to shoot for the appointment, okay, great. We're shooting for the appointment. What am I making? What's my commission? What am I making per deal that I bring aboard? Because that's going to justify if it's worth it for you to run ads, which it will be. It will be. That back end, you're selling something. If, I, if you gave me on the phone, you're selling me something. Right, right, right. Okay, so last thing, because I know your time is valuable. Now, should I get a, should I get a, like a domain, like a landing page? Like if, I, if I'm selling business credit, should I get like businesscredittoday.com? Hell yeah. Or? Hell yeah. Okay. That's your domain. Okay. That's going to be the domain you integrate into Kartra. That domain will be tied to all these pages. Okay. That's what yes. I'm going to do today. I'm going I'm to get a domain for that. And, okay. and here's how you do it. Here's how you do it. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give you a little hack. Here's how you do it. Well, actually, you got a domain. You got GoDaddy. I see you got GoDaddy up, up right there. You got a GoDaddy account already? I do. Okay. It's all good. It's all good. This is just if you want to save a few bucks. And then it's totally up to you. But if you, if you, if you go up to your browser to the top right, you see that, that, that purple G in the very top yeah. right, those dots to the right of it, those dots, click on that mm -hmm. and go into new incognito window, new incognito window. And then, and then go to, um, yeah, open up new incognito window. Okay. So I, I'll work on getting that domain too. Yeah, man. That that's one, because with the account that you're on right now, you're, you, you, it comes with one domain. So you're able to integrate one domain into the Kartra account on that $99 plan, which is all I have. I just so have I'm going to integrate. So I'm going to integrate my sales, uh, my, my, my squeeze page domain for all my pages, basically. So you're going to have one domain. Let's say mycredit.com. that one click on my pages to the left up, up at the top, my pages, click on my pages. What you'll be able to oh. do is when you go and get that domain, Actually, come back to Kartra. Yeah, right there, my pages. So as you get that domain, every single page will be mycredit.com forward slash step four. Mycredit.com forward slash thank you. Mycredit.com forward slash terms okay. of use. Okay. Right? So it's that one domain that will connect to every page. Now, now. But won't, it, it, won't it be Kartra dot no, mycredit.com? It, it, it is right now. It is right now but not when you get a domain. Oh, gotcha. I need to get a domain. Okay. Watch, come back to my page real quick or come back to my screen real quick. So I integrated, so what, can you see my you page? Let me stop share, right? Yeah, stop, stop share. share. Let me know when you can see my page. I, I can see you. Okay. So I have one domain in my account integrated okay so so as i come into any page right here get the page link so many of my pages just have the Kartra url but if i wanted and and the reason why this does is because it's a different project now i have one domain for a ton of my pages but i also have other projects going on but i don't have custom domains for them nor do i need them like i, I really don't like for example like for example, let's say for example, like like this one right here. Let me give you let me give an example before I show you the domain part. This is this is actually the same example of the domain part. But this is this is like I have my real estate agent one, right? That's the one that I sent you. That's my main business. That's the domain that I have integrated inside of Kartra. That's the domain, the 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 real estate agent.com one. That one goes to a ton of my pages. In fact, that goes to all the pages I sent you. That's my main product okay that's the one domain i have but all these other projects that i got going on this is something different this is facebook ads like this is this is this is now going this is a page that i got going to a completely different market right so up here it's the Kartra link 
But all I do is I'll go and get a custom domain because with Kartra on the $99 plan, you're only allowed one custom domain to integrate. If you want to integrate a second domain, you got you to pay more to Kartra every month, which I don't want to do because I don't need to. Because all I do is, yeah, right now you see that ugly ass link. But all I do inside of GoDaddy is I'll go grab the actual custom domain and I just forward it. So as you go to fbadsforbeginners.com, it just forwards to my, my, my Kartra page. Watch, FB Ads for Beginners will end up forwarding. It doesn't forward to this one because this is a new page, but it'll forward to my older page. Okay. Right here. So this is a different page because that's, that's where my FB Ads for Beginners. Oh, I see what you're saying. I see what you're saying. You just forward forwards. everything I just to, use the, to the one domain. I just, right. I just do the forwarding. Okay. That's for every other project that is not really my main, main project because here's the deal. As you promote that link, mycredit.com people see that when they click on that or when they go to that and they see something different ain't no one caring like no one cares right i see what you're saying like who the hell cares oh all of a sudden i see karcher in the url oh shit i don't trust gregory all of a sudden it's like ain't no one saying that like no one cares like as long as you gave right. them mycredit.com and they got there and now they see what's popping that's all they care about they don't care about what the hell's up here but as far okay. as that first link, as far as the first impression, as far as the domain that I'm sharing with the public, yeah, I don't want to share this long, long ass, ugly ass link with Kartra in it. So I ain't sharing that. I'm sharing no, no, for no. beginners. I'm sharing my custom domain. But but again, I just have it set up through GoDaddy to forward. That's all. Right. No, no, no. I feel you. So, so as so, far as my my um my regular website and domain, then I could just leave my website the way it is. I don't have to try to build my website. In Kartra, none of that. You can, you can, but here's the domain site. If I want to integrate a domain, which is what I do, I have one domain that I integrated. So whenever I create a page, Kartra gives me this long URL, but I have a custom domain integrated with Kartra. So all I got to do is hit that, hit that edit, hit the drop down. There's my custom domain. And if I, and if this was that project, I would name that page after the custom domain. So now the social real estate.com forward slash step one. So now as I go and share that link, it looks way more legit. And that's my one custom domain, but everything gotcha. else, I don't really care to, 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 to have a, a, the domain around every page, like with the social real estate agent, that one project inside of my, inside of my funnel. Yeah. Everything, everything pertaining to that one project, is around that one domain, all this stuff, all these other pages that are inside. This is all my course. These are pages pertaining to my actual course that I'm selling for 997. These are all, this is all part of, of, of selling that course. Um, the checkout page, like, like, um, here's where people go. They check out, they buy it 997. Like all these pages are around that one domain. So no one sees Kartra in any of the URLs on this one. That's my one domain, but all the other projects, I really don't care. I just do the, I just do the custom, the, the forwarding. That's all, you know, but, but in your case, okay. you got one domain in your case, go and get that GoDaddy domain and, 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 and let's set up another call and I'll help you integrate it. But it's the integration. It's super simple and it's not the most important right now. You learning all this stuff is, is kind of more important than, than your domain right now. Okay. Okay. That sounds yeah. good, man. I'm, so, I'm excited, man. I appreciate it. Yes, sir. David. So, so, so try to try to be on these Tuesday and Thursday calls, man. And if you can't, again, that's why I'm telling you the two things, Facebook ads, Kartra, if you can't be on that live one, make sure you watch the replay because that's investing in your business. That's investing in, in, in what it's going to take, man, to learn this shit. We got to learn this shit. All right. Will do, man. Appreciate okay. it, man. Right on, man. So schedule another call. Let's chat Monday for sure, man. And, and let's get this thing cracking. Okay, sounds good, Dave. All right, Thanks G. A lot. Enjoy your Have weekend. Have a good weekend, bro. Right. Thanks, man. Out right. late.